Hey y'all, so today's video is going to be my question and answer video and I'm also going to be doing my hair just because I don't have anything else to do and I really don't feel like sitting down and just answering questions so I might as well do my hair because it needs to be done. Like I got two little puffs and a bang so yeah it needs to be done. So I'm just going to be doing the um, two strand twist again because that's my favorite hairstyle now and I'm going to be answering your questions so let's get started because there's a lot of questions. And I honestly didn't think that y'all were going to ask this many questions. Like, I thought it was just going to be, like, three people and about, like, one or two questions. But y'all came through with the questions. So, thank you. I appreciate it. All right. So, let's get started. What type of job do you plan on getting once you're done with school? Um, I honestly want to own my own business. So, I want to have my own online boutique. And I also really want to go far with YouTube so I'm really praying and hoping that you know by the time I'm done with school I'll be able to have that as a source of income so yeah that's that's what I want to do once I'm done with school own my own business and have YouTube as like my I guess my second job but do you plan on getting married and having kids one day yes girl I pray that I get married. I really want to get married. Like, y'all y'all don't understand. I'm really romantic. Like, I'm a romantic girl. So, of course, I want to get married. And I also want to have a big wedding. And, yeah, like, that's, that's honestly one of my dreams is to get married one day and just be happily in love with my husband. And, of course, I want some kids. I want some little bad kids running around my house. So, yeah. What would you do if you were a man for one day? Hmm, that's a pretty good question. If I was a man for one day, um, um, what would I do? I should probably comb all my hair out. Like, what am I doing? Okay, if I was a man for one day, I guess I would. I would probably walk around topless, cause you know, we have us girls have boobs and stuff and we can't just be walking around. I mean, we can, but I'm not going to because that's just crazy. What does your family think about you having a YouTube? They think it's great. <laughs> I feel like once I had first started my YouTube, they were more excited and now it's just like, okay, she has a YouTube. But I feel like, you know, they're, they're happy about me having a YouTube. They're proud of me. Even though they don't, you know, always say it, but I feel like I feel like they are. What advice would you give to a new YouTuber? I would say don't give up. Don't get discouraged even though like even if you're not getting a lot of oh my gosh. <laughs> even if you're not getting a lot of views at first, do not get discouraged. Keep going, keep being consistent and sooner or later your hard work will pay off and be patient. I have a hard time being patient like I just want to see results right now, but I know that's, you know, that's just not going to happen. So I'm just going to keep working hard and being patient and my results will come. So that's the, that's the advice I would give to a new YouTuber. How old am I? I am 19 years old. I'm from Virginia. Do I like being natural? Yes, I love it because there's just so many different things I could do with my hair. Um hardest part about being in college I would say for me the hardest part about being in college is making friends because well I have a hard time making friends anyways but yeah that's that's the hardest part like I just I don't know I'm not the type of person that could just walk up to somebody and be like hey do you want me my friend that's just that's just not me so yeah that's the hardest part about being in college advice for college freshmen I would say do not procrastinate and no 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 this is no this is some good advice right here make sure that you check um what is it called ratemyprofessor.com that's y'all if i would have checked that i would have not been in that economics class like i would have definitely got me a good professor so make sure that before you pick your classes check ratemyprofessor.com so that you can read about the professor i figured it out after I had picked the class and, you know, started getting bad grades, that's when I had, um, you know, figured that out. So, yeah, make sure you go to that website and check out the professors before you just choose them. 
that's some good advice right there. Make sure y'all make sure y'all take that advice because that's a real good one. And yeah, don't procrastinate. Where do you see yourself in five years? Um, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. I'll be 24, so I'll be done with college. Um, I want to be in a different, live in a different state. Honestly, well, I feel like that might be, that might be too much to say. But I don't want to, honestly, I don't want to get married, like, at an old age. I want to get married, you know, at a, at a reasonable age. So, well, I'm not going to say married, but I want to be in a, a really good, stable, happy relationship by the time I'm 24. And this is, this is me. This is, you know, what I want to do. So don't, don't judge. But I want to start having kids. So... Because I don't want to be having kids, you know, when I'm like 40 or close to 40. I want to start having them like, you know, kind of young. Not right now, but like at the age of 24, I want to, you know, if I'm with somebody. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, but I don't know how to explain that. Um, but yeah, I want to I want to be in a different state. I want... At the age of 24, I'll just be, you know, really getting finished with college and stuff. So I want to be moving to another state. My dream is to be in a loft apartment. I don't want to live in a loft apartment for forever, but that's like my dream apartment. So I want to be in a loft apartment. I'm praying that I should really have lots of subscribers and I should definitely, you know, be able to have this as a source of income. So yeah and then um in five years i should definitely be doing good with my business so yeah my favorite colors are red and purple what are my plans for the summer honestly my plans for the summer are to just work i'm currently looking for a job i have literally the hardest time finding a job like Everybody else around me can get a job, but me, I'll apply for the job, I'll call them, they won't call me back, I'll leave voicemail, they still won't call me back. Um, like, it's literally a hassle for me to find a job, but that's honestly what I'm doing right now. So my plans for the summer are just to work and, of course, make YouTube videos, um, have a little bit of fun, and yeah. Do I have any tattoos? No, I'm honestly not a big fan of tattoos. But if I were to ever get one, it would be small and it'll most likely be my mom's name or like her birthday or the day that she died, the date that she died. So yeah, I'm not really a big fan of tattoos, so no. Um, relationship advice. Oh, my arm hurt. Um, relationship advice. I would say do not settle. Like if if the guy is not romantic okay every every guy is not romantic but if you have to constantly ask him like okay um let's do something i want to do something can we do something today and it never gets done or when am i going to see you when is this going to happen and it just it never happens do not do not settle that's like that's honestly some some relationship advice that I can give is just to not settle because there's somebody out there that will literally do anything with you. Anything that you want to do, they'll be willing to do it. Don't settle. Um, my favorite song artists, my two husbands, Dave East and Moneybag Yo. Those are my two favorites. And then I love Lil Baby. So my three tops are Dave East, Moneybag, and little baby, I should make up a name for my subscribers. What would y'all want to be called? Like, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> what would y'all want to be called? Leave some names in the comment section, and I guess we can, like, you know, go from there. Whichever one is the coolest, then that's what we'll go with. Um, why did I make a YouTube? Well, um, I wanted to make a YouTube because. When I was in high school, I would just watch prom vlogs and stuff. 
and I always wanted to do one. So once the time came for my prom, I was like, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm doing this. So, I mean, I guess just from watching other people's videos and stuff, that just made me want to make a YouTube. I honestly never thought that, I'm not, I don't have a lot of subscribers, but you know, I have 1,000, I'm almost at 1,300. So yeah, I don't have a lot, but I never would have thought that um, I would have companies, you know, a little bit of companies emailing me to do reviews and stuff. I never would have thought that. And I never would have thought that I would have this many subscribers. I never thought that it would go this far. So yeah, I just, I guess I made my YouTube just because I wanted to make the, do the prom vlog and just from watching other people's videos. So yeah. Are you scared of anyone you know personally or in your area seeing your videos? I wouldn't say scared. I would say more like curious of like what they're saying when they're watching my videos and what they're thinking. I wouldn't say scared though. Um, can I tell story times? Well, I'm not gonna do that in this video, but I can tell story times. I just gotta figure out what I would tell y'all. <laughs> um, I, do I got some story times, some good ones? Um. Yeah, I would. Ha I could do that, but I would have to think of some. Like I don't know, right off the top of my head, right now. What is my major? My major is business marketing. Am I insecure? I wouldn't say that I'm insecure. Yeah, I wouldn't. No, I don't think I'm insecure. Um, do I plan on having children? If so, how many, and what would you name them? Yes, I do plan on having children. I want five of them little rascals. I want five of them. Um, <laughs> I want three girls and two boys, and I would tell y'all the names, but you know, I'm pretty sure there's already some kids out here with the same names that I want my child to be, but I'm just not gonna tell y'all because you know, y'all just might steal my child's name. So yeah. But I'm, I'm more than certain that y'all will know whenever I do have kids, y'all will know the names because I'm not going to stop, you know, being on YouTube. So, yeah, y'all will know when that time comes. What are your plans after you finish college? Well, I guess I just answered that basically. Um, my plans after I finish college <laughs> would be to, I really want to be way further than I am now on YouTube and I want to have my business up and running doing good um I want to be out of Virginia I do not want to stay here forever I love my family but your girl gotta go it's honestly dead here like um I was so ready to come home from college like just because I didn't want to be in that room anymore like I didn't want to stay there anymore but once I came back here, it's it's so, it's dead in Virginia. Like, it's really dead. There's nothing here for me. <clears throat> and honestly, I just, I feel stuck being here. Like, there's just, there's nothing here. There's honestly nothing here. So, I, like, honestly, when I finish college, I really want to move to a different state. And I'm praying that I'll be able to do that. And everything will work out financially because I, I can't like I can't do it I can't stay here this Virginia is not for me <laughs> what is your favorite clothing brand I love Fashion Nova and Forever 21 those are my favorites what do you hope to get out of starting a YouTube I hope to have this as a source of income one day I really hope to work with different brands and I oh, hope that with like YouTube, I'll be able to like really do good with my own business because you know, you know how there are people that um, do YouTube and they get really big up here and then they start their own business and then they end up um, having lots of supporters. So yeah, I wanna, you know, have get my YouTube really, really big, get up there and people just love and support me, love my videos. Um, Honestly, I just want to, I don't know, I just want to like inspire people like for for anything like with my videos. That's that's honestly what I want to do is inspire people. Like if you want to 
do a YouTube. I hope that I inspire you to make you, you know, want to do a YouTube. And, um, yeah. I want to be able to one day go to the, you know, cool YouTube events and get invited to different places and stuff like that. And I hope that one day I get to meet other YouTubers and we can be friends and stuff. So, yeah, I hope that, I hope that explains. What is your biggest dream and fear? My biggest dream would honestly be to be successful in what I think my success is, like what I think success is to me is um, just accomplishing my goals, basically. My goal is to one day have my business and I want my business to be successful. I want to be able to do whatever I want. Like I um I'm not I'm not rich and I'm not wealthy. I don't have a lot of money right now. So I hope that one day I will have a lot of money. And one thing that I really want to do is travel the world, go wherever I want. And I want to be able to do that with my grandma. Because me, me and my grandma, like, that's that's my best friend. So, I want to be able to be like, all right, grandma, where you want to go? Let's go next week or something. Let's go here next week. And, you know, just be able to go and not have to worry about how this is going to get paid or how can I do this. I want to do this, but I don't have the money. Like, I don't want to have to worry about any of that. So, yeah, that's my, that's my biggest dream. And I want to be an inspiration to other girls. And I want people to look up to me and you know think of me as a go-getter and someone that didn't give up somebody that li literally started with nothing and ended up making something out of nothing so yeah that's that's my biggest dream my biggest fear would be failing like i i hate failing like the curl pattern do i have i'm honestly not into all of that so i have no idea what my curl is, but I guess y'all can kind of see it right here. If y'all know what it is, y'all can comment down below, but yeah, I'm not into that stuff, so I don't know. <clears throat> but that's actually all of the questions, and I'm not even close to being done with my hair, but I'm not going to keep this video going on any longer since I'm done. So, I hope that I, you know, really answered all of y'all's questions. Make sure that y'all comment down below and like um give me some names that y'all would want to be called because <laughs> i don't know if you have any video suggestions or anything just comment down below and i will get to them it might take a little while but i will do them thank you guys for watching and thank you guys for loving me and supporting me and loving my videos and everything yeah i love you guys bye y'all